Today's match for you, it's USA against Netherlands. Well, this is a match-up between two international teams today. The disadvantage, Alan, is that they don't play together very often. The positive, of course, is they are the country's very best players. They are indeed, and we have got some quality players to enjoy out there today, but, uh, as you say, not all of them have played together too often, so there might be a slight lack of understanding at times. And now it's time for the national anthems. This is how the USA line up. Well, we've gone with a 4-3-3 formation here for them. Is that the way you see it, Alan? Yeah, I mean, it can be adjusted. It could almost be a 4-5-1 if they decide to come over all defensive, this team. But uh, if they're on the front foot, that three up front can cause the opposition back four some problems. I think the women's game now running in tandem with the men's game with all the different competitions, European Championships, World Cups. It's a very exciting development and there's no doubt that the standards are going up with the intensity of the competition. And I think the players involved, what they would be encouraged by is the fact that the crowd seem to be getting bigger and the profile on television, in the media, has increased over the years. There's no doubt as broadcasters we get invited to cover women's tournaments as much as men's tournaments now, which would never have happened 20, 25 years ago. Yeah, I mean, I think the level of competition in these tournaments now makes it more appealing to a worldwide audience, you might say. Some options now for the pass. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Must take the lead here. That's a corner. Here is Lindsay Horan. Not a threat at the moment, but they have got the ball. Got to be. Big moment in the final. The first goal. A course for celebration. That really well worked. get a lot of satisfaction as a goal-scoring forward for knocking one in from that distance you know you're in the right place no, it was a poacher's effort the final finish wasn't difficult but to get there it took a little bit of instinct Now it's Rapino. Morgan. Real chance. And it's a shot now. One in front. They would be a lot more comfortable if they were two in front. And they really could have been. Yeah, might they look back on that with a bit of regret because that was a great chance to extend the lead, wasn't it? Lloyd. Lindsay Horan. Shot off. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. That little bit of daylight that they were after. Well, she scored an outrageous goal. Outrageous. Well, the goalkeeper, for certain, was not expecting that. I was neither, to be honest. And here is another angle on that goal. the final whistle and that confirms what we've been knowing for some time that they are the champions Alan 
Yeah, absolute joy amongst those players. They've worked long and hard, haven't they, over the course of the last nine months or so, and boy, they deserve it. These are special moments for a very successful team. Congratulations to them. Wonderful scenes of joy here. And no wonder they're milking the moment. They want to make absolutely the most of this. Well, they're a proper team, aren't they? They've stuck together, defended really well in this competition and snatched the goals at the uh, vital time. So, fully deserved winners. There they go. They are the champions. It's all part of a very special day, this, isn't it? To go and share the moment with the supporters. Yeah, and I know the family up in the stands too. It's one of those days you do not forget in a hurry. Brilliant scenes here. you have to have the team photo and they're getting ready for it now they're one of those lovely scenes that you'll hang on the wall back at home